Let's take a moment to reflect on the career of Joseph Anthony Foy, an American third baseman who left a mark in Major League Baseball. Born on February 21, 1943, in New York City, Joe Foy's baseball journey began when he signed as an amateur free agent with the Minnesota Twins in 1962. However, it was with the Boston Red Sox who drafted him later that year, where he truly made his debut. In 1965, while playing with the Toronto Maple Leafs in the International League, Foy's talent shone through as he clinched the most valuable player and rookie of the year titles, alongside winning the batting title with a 302 average. He stepped up to the majors in 1966 with the Red Sox, batting 262 and scoring impressively high in walks and on-base percentage, making him a standout player during a pitching-dominated era. Foy's career took a turn when he was picked by the Kansas City Royals in the 1968 expansion draft. His performance there continued to impress with a 262 batting average and 71 RBIs in 1969, a career high for him. However, his trade to the Mets and later shifts, including a stint with the Washington Senators, saw fluctuating performances, shadowed by personal struggles. Joe Foy's post-major league life saw him working as a counselor for troubled youth, giving back to the community until his untimely death from a heart attack on October 12, 1989. His legacy, marked by moments of brilliance on the field and challenges off it, remains a poignant chapter in baseball history.